But that's a beautiful representation. Oh, sometimes we're going to get to go to heaven. And heaven is, and the New Jerusalem is going to come down here. And when the New Jerusalem comes down here, we're going to get to be in the presence of God. Isn't that going to be wonderful? And that's a little picture of like where the angels and the elders would be. And that shows Jesus in a throne. To him that overcomes will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame him and, and sat down with my father in his throne. But just because there's a throne, don't forget, God can be everywhere. But he gave us Jesus to be able to see and know him, right? All right, one more picture. Here we go. Wow. Jesus is coming back in the clouds. Oh, that will be a wonderful day. All the angels blowing their trumpets. It's going to be a wonderful day. <coughs> so, there's a throne in heaven. And it's got amazing things that we can't even figure out. And God is bright like what? Fire. God is bright and powerful. Aren't you glad he gave us Jesus to walk around down here so we could actually meet him and know him and figure out what he's like? Amen. Yeah, I'm glad. True. All that brightness. I don't have any body yet. So I'm so glad God gave us Jesus. Can we have a prayer now? And then you can go back to your seats. And when you listen to the pastor today, I want you to listen careful because he's going to talk to us more about what Ezekiel saw, at least a little bit. Let's pray. Father in heaven, thank you so much for this time to be together. And please bless our young people to put their feet on your path and never look back because we want to walk one day straight into heaven just like Enoch because Jesus is coming soon. Bless us now to listen and, and learn. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.